Mindset and DJ X, the Ben Davis and Kelly K Show podcast. Supplying every demand. On demand. Every week at this time, we kind of throw it out there for you to help someone who may have a, an issue that they can't seem to work and figure out. Now, a lot of people message us, um, and a lot of times we try to get in touch with them. Now, this was the case here, and we're not going to say this guy's name because we tried to get in touch with him, but um, we just couldn't get a hold of him. But um, nonetheless, he wanted us to work this out. He rethought it. Once he sent it to us. So I feel like there could have been like, I don't know if I want to be the one to say this on the radio. Yeah. Like he wants the help, but then, okay. All right. So we have microphones and lots of opinions. This is free therapy with the Ben Davis and Kelly K show. So you'll figure out why pretty quickly. So it's what he says. I love my fiance. We haven't had any real problems or arguments during the quarantine, but there is a problem that I have that she doesn't know about. Uh, okay. She's been completely off of work during this time, and yeah. she's really taken it as a vacation from everything. Okay. She's worn only yoga pants, big sweatshirts every day. I mean, every day. That is it. Same. She doesn't do her hair. It's just pulled back every day. She just lays around watching TV. She's actually put on a couple pounds. Ooh. It's like she's given up. Now, I don't want to make a big deal out of it, but I'm still here, and I still want her to be the woman I fell in love with. I get it. I understand that you want to take a break during this time, but it's getting ridiculous. Mm. If I say something, I know it's going to be a problem, but it's a problem for me that she just seems to have given up and doesn't care. So should I say something? Ah, wow. Is this what I have to look forward to after we get married and she stops working to have kids? Oh. I don't want to get over the top with this, but I'm worried. What do you think? I mean, I can see why he had second thoughts about doesn't necessarily want to deliver right that here. himself right, exactly. on the radio. Yeah, his voice might uh, might be implicating there. But uh-huh. I mean, here, if it, I my my thing is, if you love her, you like for richer, for poorer, for sickness and health, for yeah. quarantine or no, yeah, for quarantine and no, for yeah. I mean, yeah. I, I think there are ways that you can be active together and you can put that out there and that's what i was thinking is kind of like hey why don't we start a a work and make put it more on you like hey i want to do this for me let's do it together or you could do a like date night yes and you could make dinner have plans you get yourself gussied up create a menu yes and tell her you know what listen six o'clock Friday, I want you dressed up because we're going out on a date. Yes, in the living room. Dining room. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> uh, my I like room, that. My room texts in and says, run, brother, run. Yeah. Um, okay. Wait, wait, wait. Wait a run. second. Run? As in my, leave her? My no, room's... Listen. My, my room. She's on coronation. That doesn't mean that you need to leave her. There that, are ways that's that what, that's you what can my, get her back to normal. My room's just cutting and running. <laughs> He's like, listen, <laughs> listen. Savage. Okay. So, anyways, if you want to comment, we'll post it so you can uh, uh, have uh, you know your say be heard uh, at Ben and Kelly Show, or you can always text at five zero two five seven one ninety nine seventy with free therapy. Got some uh, Facebook comments. Casey says, if you don't like them at their worst, you don't deserve them at their best. Okay. Okay. Uh, Angela, he doesn't. What happens after she has a baby and doesn't have time or want to do all those things till death, dude? Uh, He doesn't say anything. Says, wow, the real advice needs to go to her. Get out now if he's that shallow. Oh, wow. Ernie texts in and says, there's no cure for laziness. Ooh. Mm. You're going back and forth on this, I feel like. Yeah, Jamie says, has he thought she could be depressed from all this? Well, I I think it's not necessarily, he didn't mention it was a depression. She's just like super on vacation, like Um, totally enjoying not having to have any responsibilities. uh, Yeah, another text from a listener says the dude should be happy that his significant other is comfortable around him. Women are held to a higher standard and are expected to be on point 100% of the time. How unfair. Yes, they are. Yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> I agree with that. that. 
<laughs> I agree. Yeah. Text continues, uh, what happened to loving someone for who they are and not what they look like? All right. Valid point. So, okay. Yeah, Again, I, mean, I don't know if we helped. I, I don't think I, we did. I think we just kind of put it out there. And I think let... we attacked both of them. <laughs> <laughs> and so maybe we just need to, let's just love each other. Uh, and and feel grateful that you found someone to share your life with, and let's uh, let's challenge each other to be better. All right. If you want to continue commenting, you can Facebook, Twitter at Ben and Kelly Show.